tourist journey to nationhood, change has been one of the constants. The nation's ability to thrive in the face of change is a key factor which puts Singapore into the upper realms of first world economies. Core to Singapore's standing and its adaptability is how our built environment has transformed over the years. How we live, work, play and learn have been essential to Singapore's adaptability and will again frame the nation's course between now and 2030. Considering how Singapore will look like in 2030 triggers thoughts on how things were in the past. Singapore has always embraced its past, its environment, and its unique melting pot of cultures when charting its future course. In my mind, this national identity makes Singapore one of the original smart cities. The rise of the Central Business District as one of the world's premier commercial hubs, the success of our public housing program, our world-class infrastructure, connectivity and education are all pivotal moments in Singapore's rise as a smart city and its future as a smart nation. Singapore's rapid growth from a small fishing port into a world-class city that is globally connected and digitally savvy has set the stage for its evolution into a smart city. In 2030 and beyond, my generation will have a chance to build our vision for Singapore, while our views of how we live, work, play and learn are different from other generations, our values remain the same. As we continue to make our mark on policy, design and experience, we will keep in mind the same grand dreams, the drive for excellence and the determination to prevail that laid the foundation for Singapore's success and will make our ambition to develop a leading next generation smart city a reality. The link between the past and future will be essential to framing Singapore's 2030 landscape. To continue this smart city conversation, we look forward to welcoming our guests to the 2019 CBRE Symposium on October 9th at Marina One.